Hey guys, Jew here. Uh, today we're going to discuss about Kohaku Koifi's genealogy and his story. Um, Kohaku is the very important variety of Japan because <clears throat> it reminds all the Japanese of their national flag of Japan because its color is white and red only and especially the Tancho Kohaku it really looks like their Japanese flag and there's a saying in the Koi world there's a saying keeping the Nishiki Koi begins with the Kohaku and ends with the Kohaku here First people attracted by the beauty of the Kohaku Koi and charmed by the Shua or the Ogon. But finally, they go back to the Kohaku Koi again. That means that Kohaku Koi is the prototype of the Nishiki Goi. So, here. I'll show you their origin. Um, first, it was around... 1800 that a red and white koi appeared for the first time. So there's a, in 1800, there's a white and red koi uh, appeared due to mutation in 1800. And then by mutation, a koi with red chicks called Ukazuki was born from a black carp and then there's a new uh, mutation of koi that have uh, red cheeks here its face have red coloration so it was called Ukazuki and it was born from a black carp and then a white koi was born from Hukasuki. So uh, the Hukasuki uh, produced a white koi. So the white koi being mated with, with a hey goi. A white koi with he markings was breed called Hara Aka Red Belly. Uh, <clears throat> so the white koi, the white koi from uh, the new white koi was breed by uh, Red Red koi, the he koi. Higoi means red koi. So they breed the white and red. Uh, their offspring is the Hara Aka or red belly. It is a white koi then it with a red belly. So later, koi with he markings, he means red. Koi with uh, red markings on the gills covers here. Irahi red gills. Irahi means red gills were bred. So there, there's a koi fish uh, that's white that have uh, red gill covers. It was called Irahi. So later in 1830, a Zukin Kaburi, whose head is partly red, uh, Men Kaburi, whose whole head, whole head is red. This is the Zukin Kaburi, partly red, uh, ang yang koan head. So. This is the Minkaburi. Ang the whole red, ang yang whole head red jutsya. 
Min Kaburi. So, excuse my drawing, it's just so cartoonish. So, uh, Min Kaburi, whose whole head is red, a uh, kochi bini of which lips are red. So, there appear also a uh, kochi bini. Um, a white koi and red lips and then there appeared an sarasa which has red and white markings on the back where bread here white and red markings so in the Meiji era kohako spreads all over Yamakushi and were improved it was by Gusuki si Mr. Gusuki a uh, breeder of Otogi that so called modern Kohaku was breed so Otogi is a part of Ohia city now his real name was Konisu Hirui. He mated a male koi for the cherry blossom pattern with a female which had a red head. So, at Atomyomo inherited Gosuke's excellent Kohako and Yaguzin and Guita followed him. So, So that's the history of what we have uh, seen the Kohaku now. So this is now the modern Kohaku. And this is the product of the breeding and the mutation started here from uh, white and red koi in the 1800 then mutated by crossbreeding the offsprings here so the breeders keep on developing the kohaku until now we have these beautiful different types of kohako like street red kohako, nidan kohako, there's two steps pattern, the sandan one, two, three, the three step, yondan four step, one, two, three, four, inasuma, tanchu kohako, Kuchibini, the red lips, Minkaburi Kohaku, Homuyo Kohaku, Street Red, so on and so forth. So, if you have any question, guys, uh, regarding Kohaku, just visit this link. Kuaku Kui from my site, jubilkoicenter.com. Kuaku Kui. There is a lot of information here about Kohaku. Here you can. I think I need to expound this so that you will really understand. Okay, so also if you want to learn more about different types of koi fish, you can visit here types of koi. And if you want to learn more about Sanki, click the link Sanki koi fish here, for example. Here, Sanki also have different. Uh, Variety based on their markings. And here, so you will learn how to choose a uh,
good quality sanki. So comment down below guys if you have any questions and also don't forget to join the 5k giveaway subscriber promo that I will be giving away to Koi Fish Ring for lucky winners when I reach 5,000 subscriber. I put the video below in the description. Uh, just comment your fish keeping stories for fish keeping stories and other fishes where you started the hobby, what makes you join the hobby, and so on and so forth. Also, you can message me at Facebook. Just search uh, Geobel Koi Center. Here. Okay, that's it for now guys, bye for now, thanks for watching and for those new watching and visiting my channel, please do subscribe and don't forget to hit the red bell notification button for updates of my new videos. Bye for now guys.